Hi, this is Willem here from Bunny Pants Graphic Design Studio. Um, this morning I want to quickly explain how to use the, the widget kit uh, component uh, of uh, Zoo for Joomla. And um, what I want to explain to you specifically is um, how to update and change a moving banner um, with the widget kit. Um, so um, we recently rebuilt the website for client vol info. And um, this moving banner they've got here um, is uh, built on uh, the zoo component called the widget kit. And um, this morning I just want to quickly show you, we want to add a, uh, a banner for the client. So um, first we need to do is uh, log into the admin side of the website. Okay, I've already logged in um, before. Um, so what I'll do is I will go to components, then I'll go to the widget kit um, part of Zoo. Okay, as soon as I'm in the uh, widget kit, um, I will go to gallery, um, and I'll go to slideshow. And then I'll go to the slideshow I've created for this client, it's called homepage ba banners. So as soon as we're in this uh, part of widget kit, we'll see we've got our first banner. It's called, um, we, we titled it uh, Banner 1. Here's the first image. Here's our Banner 2, our Banner 3, and um, our Banner 4, and so on. And uh, if we look here at the side, uh, we've got our settings for our moving banner. It's uh, set to auto play, start playing. We've got our uh, auto play interval in milliseconds, how long it should take to um, display each um, banner. Um, we have got our uh, weight, our, our width and our height. It's set to auto because I've already got the right sizes for the banners. And um, what's more important here is how it will actually, what the animation will be. At the moment it's, uh, it's got the, that effect. Um, so what I need, if I need to add an additional banner, I'll have to go to the bottom of uh, all my other banners. I see the last one's banner 5. Um, so what I can do is I can just say here at the bottom, add new item. <coughs> it gives me the opportunity to give it a new name. So what I'll do is I'll just copy that name and call it banner 6. I will uh, click in my editor. And you'll see I'm using Joomla's uh, CK editor um, in this instance and not, not the, the default editor. This one is much better and it's got lots more functions, especially when it comes to importing images. So this image I want in the center, so I will actually set my cursor to the center of the page. And I will click on image button. And then um, I'll go to the folder where I've got my banners. It's called Homepage Banners. You can create any uh, folder on a new website. And yeah, we'll actually see um, some of my old banners, some of the banners I've been using. Um, so what I'll do, I'm just going to add that specific banner to this. I'll go to um, Upload Image. I'll go and browse to this client's um, folder on our website, uh, on our server. Um, yes. And a client has asked us to um, upload this banner, um, the one they've created, so I'm just going to rename it. Let's say to banner six just to make sure the size is okay okay it's nice and small and kilobytes and uh, the size is exactly right in, uh, in pixels so what i'll do is i'll double click on the banner i'll say upload it has uploaded our image here what i'll do is i'll just click on it again so it updates here and then I'll say insert. Okay, I've inserted it. I see it's still not centered, so I'll just click on the image again and center it. And um, what I can do now is I'm going to go and save. And then I can 
can go and preview my site. If we quickly browse through it, um, you see it comes up. So let's say we want to move our banner maybe to the um, to the first um, or the second maybe banner here. I can go back and I can go here at the bottom and it's, it states our order. So I can just take banner six and I can actually drag it to position two. And I can just go and save. And uh, I can just refresh the website and it should be banner two now. There you go. Okay, what we also can do, we can link our banner to something else. So if, if I click um, on this specific banner, it's our, uh, it's the Facebook banner they've created. It'll actually take me to the Facebook website. Um, so what I'll do is, I'm just going to show you how we can link this. We can also link this banner, maybe if the client had their own um, website. So we can go back to widget kit and we can go and click on our banner itself, highlight it, and then we can go to the link um, button and we can actually go and click on it. And we can actually just go and put the, the URL of wherever this uh, banner should go. So um, if I update it, let's say, and I say, Like that, and I can just set my target. Um, if if it's if it's a link internal to the website, I won't set my target. If it's an external link, I will just say open a new window. We never want the people to browse away from your website and uh, not have it in the background. So if I put insert and I go and save it again, and I go and refresh here, and I um, just waiting for the second banner. If I click on this banner now, it will actually go and uh, open Bunny Pants website in a new window. Um, so yeah, that's how we click uh, or, or link uh, internal um, uh, banners, moving banners. If it's an internal link, I can actually go and just click on, uh, let's say I want this, but that banner to go to the Vol Monthly Edition book on their website. I've got the flip page book. If I want this to um, go to this flip page book, what I can do is I can just go and click and copy that complete link there. I can go back, click on this. You can drag it a little bit bigger. I want to see the whole uh, editor. And I can just go and unlink it. Click on the link again. And I can go and paste it. You can either use that or what we can do is we can go to our menu and link it internally to a menu item. But uh, then you need to know what the menu item is going to be. So uh, let's choose, um, let's say, the whole info edition link on our website. Press, um, just want some anchor text. And uh, if I save it now and refresh on the front side, Go back to the web. To our main website. And I click on my second banner. Well, it hasn't saved it. So just go back here. That, uh, that link just to save some time now and uh, if I put in the uh, insert save it and if 
का कि कितना हुए तो एक्चुअली घर तो इंटर नो नहीं का एक्सेलेंट एंड एंड सर वो हैव टू अपडेट एडिशनल बैनर्स विथ द विजिट की कंपोनेंट इन जुमला विथ द मॉड्यूल कोड जूम थैंक यू